As a site owner, you want to make more money. To do that, you need to know how to improve your conversions. So today, we're going to show you how you can easily set up add to cart tracking in Google Analytics without editing code or knowing your way around analytics. And we'll show you how you can see that data right on your WordPress dashboard. The add to cart metric is critical for showing you how many people are adding at least one product to their cart. Having access to those metrics allows you to group your visitors into different segments and then create targeted marketing messages. So for instance, you can segment people who add products to their carts, but don't check out to reduce cart abandonment. Don't miss the link in the description about that. Or you can target people who visit different product pages, but don't add any items to their carts. Monster Insights automatically sets up add to cart events for you in Google Analytics without any additional configuration, and you won't have to edit any code. First, if you haven't already done so, you'll need to purchase Monster Insights Pro by going to monsterinsights.com. Now, once you've made your purchase, you'll just need to download the zip file from your account area under the Downloads tab. Once it's downloaded to your computer, then you'll need to upload the plugin to your WordPress site. Now, to do that, all you have to do is go to your admin sidebar, hover your mouse over Plugins, and then click on Add New. Next, click on the Upload Plugins button at the top of the page. Then hit the Choose File button, or you can drag and drop the zip file over this area and hit the Install button. Once the plugin's been installed, simply hit the Activate Plugin button. Next, you'll need to connect Monster Insights to your Google Analytics account. Now, it's simple. Just follow the steps using our Setup Wizard. Now, if you're still a little unsure, that's okay. You can read our step-by-step -step guide on properly setting up Google Analytics and Monster Insights, and it will walk you through the entire process. Now we'll install the Monster Insights e-commerce add-on. Now to do that, you'll just need to hover your mouse over Insights on your admin sidebar. Then click on Add-ons. And then locate the e-commerce add-on and click Install. All right, you're almost there. Now that you've activated the e-commerce add-on in Monster Insights, the next thing you'll need to do is turn on Enhanced e-commerce in Google Analytics. Now don't worry, it's really simple. First, you'll need to head over to your Google Analytics account and log in, and then select the website that you'd like to enable Enhanced E-Commerce for. Then at the bottom left of the screen, you'll need to click on Admin. Next, in the right column, you'll need to click E-Commerce Settings. Now you're looking at the E-Commerce Setup page, so just move the slider from Off to On. Once you do that, another slider will appear labeled Enable Enhanced E-Commerce Reporting. So go ahead and move that slider from off to on as well. All right, now you'll need to remember to hit that Save button, and you're done here. Now we're going to enable Enhanced E-Commerce in Monster Insights. On your admin sidebar, hover your mouse over Insights, then click on Settings. Then click on the E-Commerce tab at the top of the page, and scroll down, and enable the Use Enhanced E-Commerce option. Now Monster Insights will detect your e-commerce stores, such as WooCommerce or MemberPress, and it will start tracking Add to Cart events in Google Analytics. And that's it. You've successfully set up e-commerce tracking in WordPress. Now we're going to show you how to view your Add to Cart events. You won't even have to leave your WordPress site. To view your Add to Cart metrics, just hover your mouse over Insights, then click Reports. And then click e-commerce. All right, here you can see how your online store is performing, and you'll see your conversion rate, number of transactions, revenue, and average order value. Plus, you can see your top products, order quantity, sales percentage, and total revenue. Plus, you can also see your top conversion sources, and that way you know where your visitors are coming from and purchasing your products. If you scroll down a little, you'll also see the total Add to Carts report. That's where you can see the number of products that people are adding to their carts. And right next to that, another report for total removed from cart shows you the number of products people have removed from their cart. And that's it for this video. Now, you don't want to miss the opportunity to get Monster Insights at a really discounted price, so be sure to check out the discount link in the description and to learn more Monster Insights tips, tricks, and techniques. Just click one of the videos on your screen now.